Hello, welcome to the Intuitive Empress channel. I'm Intuitive Empress. Thank you for coming to the table to be nourished by the spiritual food that's being served up on today. This is a general twin flame message for my Libras. So take what resonates and leave the rest. In other words, while you're feasting, remember to eat the meat and don't choke up on those bones. All right? To my subscribers, thank you, thank you, thank you for your love and support in the way of likes, comments, subscribes, and shares. And to my returning viewers who have not subscribed yet, as well as my new viewers, please do take the time to hit that subscribe button as it helps the channel out greatly and the bell notification so you are notified on new videos. I do want to let you know that donations are appreciated and welcome on the channel that information is in the description as well as information on getting a personal reading because as this is a general message everything will not resonate with you all right that is the only way for you to get a reading from intuitive empress and this is the only platform i'm on so do not get scammed please do if you like this video and it resonated with you like this video and comment all right so that being said let's get into the message holy spirit can we have twin flame messages for our libras clear messages for my libra sun moon rising and venus signs sun moon rising and venus for my libras okay so what we have here Hmm. Okay, so we have a divine feminine here, or possibly a divine masculine. There is no gender in Tarot. There is just the energy of your spirit. So we have the divine feminine who is creative, nurturing, and abundant, all right, who is dealing with a knight of cups, someone who gave you a romantic invitation. But this was... Um, with someone that was immature, someone who was enthusiastic and everything and wanted to discover things about you, but in more of a sexual content. This is something that you did not know and you were working, learning and growing from this experience. Okay, you were working hard to make this work, but there was some truth that came out regarding this situation. You could have possibly been dealing with a Sagittarius. All right. We have with the Knight of Cups, we have uh, Pisces energy. With the Divine Feminine, we have Taurus energy. And we also have your energy coming out. Uh, Libra, that card just flew out. The Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus sign. So you came up in your own reading. Or you could have been dealing with a Libra as well. Um, so when the truth came out, it did cause a tower with you Libras. Okay, so there was a unex some unexpected news, a sudden upheaval, some unwanted changes. But this was the divine intervention for this Knight of Swords who was in and out of your life, who was chaotic and destructive. Um, to your life, okay, to your emotions, okay, to get you off of track from where you are supposed to be, okay, with the Knight of Swords, we have um, someone that plays with your mind, it is air energy, um, Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius energy, um, you have uh, with the Eight of Pentacles, more Taurus um, energy, with the Ace of Swords, again, that's your energy, Libra, Aquarius and Gemini. All right. So, and with the Page of Wands, we have Sagittarian energy, Leo and Aries. All right. Anything else for my Libras? Okay. So, there is some news that is going to be coming in um, very fast. This could be good news or. It could be challenging news, 
All right. But news travels fast. Possibly um, the fact that you are no longer with this person or what this person was doing. OK. I am showing that you um, walked away from this energy that you thought was going to be your person. You felt spiritually linked and bounded to this person. Um, you had more traditional values or this person had what they considered more traditional religious values with the hierophant. Okay. But this person was lying and this full of deceit, wearing a mask, had a strategy which caused the unexpected twist, which is what this um, communication may be about. I feel, also feel like this person made you feel abandoned when they walked away because they were in and out of your life. For many of you, you may not have known why they were um, so flighty. But after making some careful decisions, you tap into your warrior energy with the Aries, even though this could be someone that you were dealing with or somewhere in your chart. Um, you planned carefully um, to make the right decisions for yourself. I have one more card, Holy Spirit. One more card for my Libras, please. Thank you. All right. But there is hope, happiness, joy, and success coming to you in the way of love. This person was not um, your love interest. We also have the king of pentacles. This is someone who is more stable, someone who is faithful, which is what um, this other person wasn't. So pull on your strength, Libra. Okay. And uh, heal yourself from that toxic energy, any attachments you have to this person. Um, I feel like this person was also in materialism and greed. This person um, caused you to pull on your confidence or having to use your confidence heal so you can get that. Um, you are going to have victory and success and reach a major milestone. This person is... In the King of Swords energy, he came in in the um, Knight of Swords, but this person is really logical. This person planned this out, okay? This person is cool and distant um, intentionally. Um, this person does try to force their authority to get what they want. Very playerish energy, but you do have um, a lover coming in, a true love, a soul connection, Okay, um, someone that is going to be a true partner with you. So lay down all of those uh, burdens, feeling overwhelmed with the Ten of Wands. Okay, um, this person was too intense and did not take responsibility or accountability for their actions. But you do have someone who is going to be loving and faithful coming into you. All right, so that was the appetizer. We are going to move on to the main course to just see what is going on in your situation. All right. All right. Just had to shuffle just a little bit. Yeah, this person is very interesting. Um, they may have gotten the STI because they Again, were flighty. They were playerish energy. They were messing with more than one person. Um, so if you were um, intimate with this person, you may want to um, get a test. Let me just fix this for a second. I don't know why that's like that. Um, you might want to get a test. Okay, this might be somebody who um, was able to see into your um, future and everything to see if you were going to get money and things like that. This person is trying to keep you from getting to your twin flame um, journey because they want to um, control you. They want to have um, power over you. This person may even have threatened you if you wanted to walk away or saying that they did not want you to leave them. 
Okay, even though this person was acting very, very cold, we did, did have the cool and distant with the king of swords there. Um, and this person would accuse you of things without having all of the facts, um, lying, making stuff up to try to make you uh, feel bad and to keep you um, your reputation, mess up your reputation. OK. Anything else? Hmm. This person took a lot of pleasure in ignoring you. Okay. This is very um, narcissistic energy where this person would be in and out going for different supplies, um, going from person to person, holding back on you um, after initially love bombing you. Um, they have a feeling of ownership of you and they just feel like that you would never walk away. OK, you just kept going through the same stuff over and over and over again with this person. Um, this person could have had karmic friends or you could have had um, karmic friends, people that you secretly couldn't trust. Um, maybe you have shared friends with this person, um, people that were in secret competition with you. Um, you have your this person and also the fake friends who have fake accounts to spy on you because um, maybe you pulled back your energy um, from these karmic people and definitely from this inner now energy I, you did walk away from this person so they're looking at your social media so they can see what's going on in your life all right This person may have accused you if you have children with this person or children at all um, outside of the relationship that you are a bad parent, um, that um, that your children are scared of you or this. If you have children with this person, your children could be scared of them. OK, they could be trying to um, use your children as a tool. OK, um, you may have moved away to try to get away from this person and because you have children they will try to use the children to get information on you okay so even though this person rejected you and ultimately made you reject this person um from coming back because this person definitely wants you back this person is willing to travel to where you are um, or has been traveling, searching for you. All right. This person was thinking all about money. And as a result, they ended up being bankrupt. OK, not having any funds at all. All right. This person always had their head in the clouds. All right. Being careless. So now this person doesn't have any transportation, might be getting things repossessed, might be having um, car issues. All right. But right now you are unbothered by this person. OK, completely unbothered. All right. You're like you made your choice. You made your bed. You're going to lie in it. OK, so we're going to get some final messages for my Tauruses. All right. What are the final messages? Holy Spirit, what are the final messages that we have for our Libras? You could be dealing with someone with the initials of I, J, K, and L, a Scorpio, possibly. This person knows that you are a nurturing person. They may take advantage because of your body type, because um, you could be thick or plump um, and everything like that. Um, silence is the language of God. You have been silent. Silent. We have someone, possibly a Gemini, who drives a white car. Um, spirit is saying focus on your goals and be aware of any psychic attacks. Um, this person could have left you for someone else. 
but now they want to come back and leave the karmic because the grass was not greener. You definitely have a high calling. Um, you could be dealing with an Aquarius. Um, spirit is saying, um, cleanse your home from karmic energy. All right. Um, someone, this karmic energy, because I'm going to call it like it is, um, because everybody say, oh, you're divine masculine and they're doing all kinds of stuff. But um, they're working in karmic energy. Um, and they have a succubus spirit, so they will, um, or incubus spirit, so they will, um, you know, possibly try to be intimate with you to um, further connect with you, okay? Your energy is coming out. Someone was a hoe or a player that caused the least success in your life. Or cause delayed success for themselves just because of the energy that they were projecting out there. But you are taking inspired action, Libra. You have balanced out your energy or you're working on balancing out your energy and your emotions. And everything is going to be okay. All right. So that is the message. If you like this meal on today, please let me know by liking this video or commenting in the comment section. Thank you so much and I'll see you next time.